I drive a Leaf. I have solar on the ranch, batteries in the garage. It's just a better way to live. And we can roll climate change backward over the next 30 years if we use practices like Alan Savory's regenerative grazing, which takes carbon out of the air, puts it into the grass as it's photosynthesizing. Cow eats the grass, the roots slough polysaccharide sugars, which feed the biological community in the soil and mineralize the carbon that the grass is putting into the soil. We have all the technologies. Why aren't we doing this? And you've been saying that message for dozens of years now. Do you feel like uh, that message is getting through? What feels different today than when you started having these conversations? There are a number of things that are different. <laughs> One, this horse race with catastrophe. Catastrophe is becoming really obvious to a lot of people. Of all the Category 5 hurricanes to make landfall, a quarter, we're within the last two months. The, the fires, and we've had fires this entire summer. The damages are becoming manifest to all of us. And at the same time, the entrepreneurs are succeeding. And this, I credit SOCAP with launching this entrepreneurial movement, celebrating it, bringing the entrepreneurs together so that they can meet with investors, so that they can learn from each other so we can all learn from each other. This is the conference in all the world if you want entrepreneur solutions. So what is it about launching this ETF? What does that mean for the industry? The Change Finance ETF is 100 of the biggest companies on Wall Street that are companies that our rule set has picked to exclude all the bad actors. These are, these are publicly traded companies, but they are driving the change that we need to see. And if you watch what the big companies are doing, one after another after another are announcing. Things like Mars just announced a billion dollars that they're putting into climate protection. The work of Unilever, the, their purpose-driven brands are responsible for 60% of the company's profitability. They're only a small piece of all of their brands and they're growing twice as fast as the rest of the company. We have the opportunity to transform finance, which is the mother of all human systems. It drives trillions of dollars. Let's move money from harm to healing. And what we've done with this, this ETF is democratize your ability to invest. So, and I teach, I teach business. I teach at the Bard MBA. My students want this. Young people want the ability to make a personal difference. They want to work for a company that's clean. They want to transform the world. So let's do it.